Hi there, this is Sean from TechHume and in this video I am going to show you is how to flash Paranoid 5.1.1 on Xiaomi Mi 4i. So let's get started. So first of all, I don't take any responsibility if anything happens to your device. So now go on to the link in the description below. It is our XD developers link and then you will find this page and the credit goes to the owner of this uh, ROM and then first of all click on the uh, ASOPAL ROM and then open it and here we will, you will find two download links a ROM download link and a G app download link open both the links and then you will uh, have to choose a server for the for downloading the ROM you can choose any one of them uh, nearest to you and then start downloading so now uh, you have to download the G app so uh, you are going to take the latest one that is 27 days ago and open it now it is open now right click on it and do make sure that you have a download manager installed on your computer so it can download the file through that download manager and after some time the file size will appear now click on start downloading and uh, now after the file has been downloaded i will be back and after the file has been downloaded connect your device to the pc and then name a folder 5.1.1 and then copy all the stuff downloaded to it and as i create the folder and then copy it quickly and as I, I have already copied I don't need to copy it again and guys also make sure that you have custom recovery like TWR installed on your phone now open the updater app and then at the top you will find three dots and then switch reboot to recovery button and then reboot now now your device is being rebooted into the custom recovery TWRP and here we are guys in the team win by Mad Dag custom recovery now what you have to do is first of all go on to the wipe over at the top and then you will find a swipe a swipe like thing then swipe to factory reset and click on back and again once more the back button is present over here and then you have to go on to install and find the folder where you have kept the files so here is it is and the PA Ferrari 5.1 zip and then uh, once more you have to swipe the to confirm the flash now here we go and it is going to take some time so sit back and relax So guys after it's done now click on the home and then you will find our install button and then click on the gapps.zip1 now confirm swipe to confirm flash and now it is going to install gapps like our google and play store services now it's successfully done the home and then reboot and here we go now you have to turn on the phone using the power button for around five seconds and then you see our my logo so guys now it is going to take some time to boot and install some apps so i will be back and you guys sit back and enjoy So guys the phone finally started up and I will come back to you guys after I set it up. So I finally set it up the device and the Android version is 5.1.1 Lollipop 
and on the initial impressions the ROM is very light around 1.3 GB is free on this device which is pretty good and guys if you want a full review of this ROM you can hit the like button and comment down below and thanks for watching this is Sean signing off and peace out